Welcome to Math Theory. Today we're gonna be discussing the infamous math question 33 plus 77. And we might reveal how the government is using this math to control you. First, the basics. Now, these government agents, <coughs> I'm sorry, mathematicians, programmed all calculators to say that 77 plus 38 Three is somehow 110. Obviously that's not true, so let's determine what it really is. So, I see a lot of people thinking it's 100. Now let's discuss that. So if we break the sum up, 3 plus 7 is 10. And uh, for the other side, 3 plus 7 is 10. And if we add the two zeros that we have from our two tens, we get a uh, hundred. But wait, what happens to that final one? This is one of the most important qu questions in our society. Does the one just disappear? Maybe, but that would be like if you have three dollars in one hand and you give it to your other hand and then you have two dollars. See, it doesn't make sense. So we need to find out what happens to this missing one. One theory is it goes to the beginning, so the answer to the question uh, 33 plus 77 is 101. Obviously, this explanation makes a lot of sense, but there are many different angles we could take this at. Maybe the one goes to the end of the number and then gets added to another one, making the answer 200. Now, I feel like we're on the right track, but we've just not gotten it. But... If we take 200 and plus it with 101, we get 301. If we divide that by 2, we get 150 and a half. This is the average between the two numbers. And I think we're so close to the real answer. If we round this off, we get 151. This definitively is what I think 33 plus 77 is. I mean, it makes so much sense. I mean, if I have 33 Among Us dolls in one hand and 77 Among Us dolls in the other hand, if I put them together, I obviously will get 151. Now, that makes sense. But why would the government lie to you about this? And I think I know. Imagine you are at a grocery and you buy one item for $33, the other item for $77. Now imagine you pay for it. By paying $110, you're underpaying me because you actually have to pay $151. By forcing us to underpay the grocery stores, the grocery stores do worse. And if the grocery stores do worse, our economy does worse. If our economy does worse, we might lead to economic collapse. If our economy collapses, the government will soak everything up and turn us into a communist dystopia. So in conclusion, 77 plus 33 is communist pro propaganda. And remember, it's 151. Thanks for watching. This video's a joke.